and welcome to another episode of BrickCast Anime Talk. Recently, I was told by my girlfriend who discovered that an anime that appeared on Netflix. This anime is fully titled Sword Art Online Alternative Gun Gale Online. She asked me if I ever heard of it, and actually I had not until she told me about it. So the next time we were hanging out, we decided to watch it, and we were, and we're both really big fans of Sword Art Online. Now we didn't get too far, like episode 5 or 6 or so. Now what I noticed in the episodes that we did watch is pretty much the title of this video. I am sorry because I don't want to have to deal in spoilers in case there are people who have not watched this, but for the purpose of the topic I have to, so click away if you don't want to be sto spoiled or stay if you just don't care. So one of the things that comes up in the anime is a in-game event, since you know, it takes place in the world of Gun Gale Online and virtual reality MMO video game. The event is called Squad Jam. It's like Bullet of Bullets, but with squads. Pretty simple. Now, <clears throat> episode one, we're in this squad jam event, like action stuff. And then episode two and on is like the build up to the event, which is weird, but that's how they do it. Here's why I say the people who made this anime and manga and light novel know nothing about actual game design. Squad Jam is a battle royale event. Now the main character gets put with one person, so they're a duo. But in the anime, our duo is constantly up against squads that are made up of four or five people. Look, I've never played a battle royale game. Well, okay, I played a few minutes of the battle royale mode in CSGO, but was confused and didn't know what I was doing. Anyway, I do understand how battle royale games work. Most of them have options, like singles, duos, and squads. That means if I go into a single match, I'll be up against other people that are just one person. And the same for duos and squads. If I, if I load up the duos, it'll be my duo versus other duos. That keeps each match balanced so that no one is overpowered because they're outnumbered. That's what the anime gets completely wrong. Why is a team of two going up against teams of four or five? Now yes, through the power of plot armor, our team of two keeps pulling wins out of their asses, but seriously, the squad jam is unbalanced and not fair at all. Now they never say how many people make up a squad in the game world that the anime is in, but I always thought that a squad in a battle royale game is four or more, and that makes sense. A team of four goes up against a team of five, sure, it's not balanced, but it's only one person, so it's not the biggest deal. I'm sure some of you are saying that even regular Sword Art Online anime, they ignored actual game design, and yeah, they did, but it never felt as obvious as this to me. Balance is a key factor, especially in a multiplayer game style like Battle Royale. Now, do I think this is going to matter in the anime? No, I'm sure that our duo will keep powering through these teams that have twice or more as many people as they do, because anime. 